Alright guys, we're back and um we found Melanie. She seems to be cornered though by these guys. And they look a little like they're a little too excited to see her. You're not wrong. Come on, son. Let's take her back with us. Melanie! Ah, Captain Mayday! Lucas, please help me! Dagnabbit, they got her! Who knew Demetrius would have reinforcements? Did you see the size of that thing, Rookie? Could that be the giant bird you were after? Alright, oh, we're gonna need to climb now to get to them. And there's our black bird. And his eggs. Squawk! So you followed me right to the top. I should have known. This girl's staying with us. You make fine messmate for my boy. Oh, so he does want. That's for naughty things for his little boy. Seems you've been causing all sorts of trouble for my son. You mess with him, you mess with me. Prepare to pay a heavy price. You've got a lot of nerve wandering up here like you're, you're on the place. Looks like the enemy's about to launch a classic pincer attack. Listen, Rookie, I'll engage this one. You take the fight to the big bird. Gotcha. Don't go stand a chance against Murray. Maybe death will make you think differently! Big Bird. Gammon. Whew! That's some damage. Ah! Oh no. This guy's gonna be problems.
Oh, that sucks. I'm really gonna have to um level if we manage to take this guy down. Bounce. Hope it doesn't bounce. Physical attacks. Alright. Oh, I forgot he learned Zing. So by the next episode, we're definitely leveling. That was a close call. Even though I, I did have my um, my backups. That was pretty close. You all right, rookie? Looks like you bird brains lost. Now hand Melanie over. Forget it! The girl is yours! <laughs> Good. Now that I've got your attention, there's something I want to ask you. When the moles spoke of the uh, great beast, were they talking about you? Squat! This isn't good. She's heading this way! Come on, son, let's get out of here! Uh -huh, no. Do, do, do. Just. Watching. The oh my gosh! That's a big bird. I'm gonna eat for breakfast. I'm assuming that's the mama. I am Empyria, ruler of the skies. I take it you are the creatures known as humans. What do you want with me? I 
I see. You wish me to join you and help return you to your home. I am afraid this is a wish I cannot grant. I serve only one master. Not a... Now if you'll excuse me. That... That metal... I see. That changes everything. I take it that Don Mo directed you to come here and seek me out. He is truly committed to the future of this island. Nay, to all of us. A more trustworthy ally you could not hope to find. Now heed me well, humans. You must trust in the forces of fate. Do that and you will find the Great One and fulfill your destiny. Gone. I guess that gr the great beast the moles were talking about wasn't that bird at all. Ugh. 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 Captain Mayday! What's wrong? Somebody do something! Let's carry Captain May Mayday back to the... The ship. It pains me to report that Captain Mayday has been gravely injured. It's extraordinary that he managed to stay on his feet for so long. There's precious little we can do for him while we're on this island. We must return home and soon. Rory, dear boy, how is the repair work on the ship progressing? lie to you. It's no going well at all. It may just be Kureka to build a new ship from scratch. This is horrible. We can't just leave the poor captain like this. It's all my fault. I'm sorry, captain. I've let you do it again. And after everything we've been through together. Pardon me. Might I make a small suggestion? I propose that we leave this in Lucas's capable hands. If he can't find a way out of this bind, then no one can. Imperia told us to trust in the forces of fate. If she is right, I say we entrust our fate to Lucas. Well, okay. listen to me. Captain! Captain, you're alive! Don't overexert yourself. You shouldn't even try to speak in your condition. Squeak! Squeak! Lucas, you'd better tell the captain not to push himself too hard. It's gonna take more than a scratch to shut Captain Rex Mayday up. Now listen up, Rocky. When the Albatross took a dive, I had to swim for my life. I managed to make it to the coast. That's where I spotted an incoming bogey. The biggest monster I had ever seen. I had to beat a tactical or a cheat, which is how I ended up in the mountains. Yes, one of the ancient tomes I read spoke of a gigantic monster by the coast. Rookie. Okay. Now you're battle-hardened. I think you're ready to hit the coast. If we can't rely on Imperia to fly us out, maybe the seas are our only hope. Yes, I'll do it. Lucas can now go to the new region. Unsure. A lot of puns in this game. But yeah, I'll, we'll go down the next one, so see you then.